this is an example case uh, using the solver available from the from ESI OpenCFD uh, version of Open Foam. It's intercondensating evaporating foam or something like that. The name of the solver. It 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 allows phase change. Uh, and they have a they have a built-in example that does condensation in a tube. I ch I switched to, uh, I switched the boundary to change the boundary conditions to make it do evaporation at the bottom. So the lower wall is uh, is at held at a temperature above saturation temperature. The bulk of the fluid is below saturation temperature. The two walls on the side, the two boundaries on the sides are walls, and the top is an inlet outlet, velocity inlet outlet. Uh, the good thing is we see evaporation. It looks to to happen smoothly, with no problems. Uh, the 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 thing that's puzzling is the the behavior of this kind of evaporation. It's, it only happens at the bottom, and it never really rises up very much. Um, I'm you know, in speculating about the reason for that, I think it's because of the top boundary, because because the whole thing is filled with liquid. Uh, and the upper boundary is an inlet outlet boundary, so it never gets a chance to to for for the the, the bulk never gets a chance to to reach the the saturation temperature, and uh, that's because uh, there's always new fluid coming in from the top at this temperature of the internal field. So if I put U uh, and make it uh, y, uh, the Y component, you can see there's always new fluid coming in and when it comes in it comes in at the bulk temperature so there's new heat capacitance always coming in and that means the bulk never achieves uh, the, the saturation temperature this color here is saturation temperature and it's always limited at the bottom here it never rises all the, uh, to the top so the thing I'll try next is to uh, I'll keep all the boundary conditions the way they are, but rather than have the whole thing filled to the top, I'll have it. Uh, I'll initiate the field so that the level of the the liquid is around the middle, more or less, and then and the top would be gas. So then any fluid coming in at this boundary would be from would be the the gas temperature. It would be gas. And and I think in that kind of situation, the the liquid would be able to eventually heat up to the saturation temperature. So that would sort of, uh, I think, would solve the issue of of the evaporation being limited at the bottom, because then in that case the liquid would heat up to the to, and and then the, you'd have boiling in the bulk of the fluid. But the next thing I want to understand. Uh, is why is there no nucleate boiling? That could be because of the because of the turbulence modeling, so that everything is sort of smoothed out, so we don't get to see small nuclei. So the small scale structure is smooth, smoothed out because of the turbulence modeling. But that's something to explore later.